Welcome to the shooting show. This week we're pheasant shooting at Burt Magnus Estate, East Yorkshire. It's the first week of January. Everybody's looking forward to a great day. Our January game shoot in Bonanza continues. This week we're back up in Yorkshire as I lead a team of guns at the Burt Magnus Estate, overseen by the legendary David Nesfield. Cheers, Skip. Did they pull one out and put it back in there? They did. Morning, morning, everybody. Um, think, think everybody. Well, most people's been before anyway, but just a few. Do's and don'ts. Um, you, I assume you're moving up 3A on eight guns, are you? Yeah, sounds yeah, good. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. yeah, so you're right to left, um, moving up moving up three. Um, if you would be uh, so kind as to gather your cartridges up, please, and put them in the back of the uh, uh, bucket in the back, please. We don't shoot anything on the ground at all, and that includes foxes. Um, they are getting a little bit, uh, we're nicely into January now, we're pretty well through our programme, they are getting a bit thinner on ground, so uh, they'll uh, do their best to give you a good day, uh, as, as the rest of us will, uh, just hope you uh, enjoy it. Wasting no time, we'll make our way to the first pegs of the day. I've drawn the short straw, and we'll have cameraman Stuart with me. At least I have someone to blame any misses on. Still a woodcock, and uh, yeah, missed a straightforward chance at a woodcock thanks to the cameraman Stuart Wilson. Hello. And another one. Trusty Zenith. 32 fives. It's easy with Ely. Loosened up eventually? Eventually, yeah. A bit stiff to start with. Well, it's only second day. Yeah. What in last? Yeah. Rifle shooting isn't a good practice for shotgun shooting, I'm afraid. 
After helping make sure all the birds are picked, we move on. Before the second drive, I managed to give Stuart the slip, but he makes do with the next best thing, my brother Sean. Let's see how he fares with his traditional choice of gun. Don't you be shy. Yeah, early Zenith, 32 gram fabs, as usual, on the cat with the use. AYA number four, good little game gun. Uh, I've got a pair of them. Uh, Can you alternate them? Uh, well, generally use the number one all the time. Yeah. But obviously, if one's in for service, I've got another gun I can drop straight onto that's, you know, fitted the same like. I've done both fitted. Uh, Rob Hall at uh, Market Week and did them for me, like. One stayed a little bit better than the uh, cast altar in on it. <clears throat> Do that very often. Yeah, it goes like that. Come on, mate, did 180, went yeah. back to the road. Yeah, it's like it yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. It's been a productive day so far. This is late in the season. The birds are strong on the wing, making for some challenging high shots. Drive three, and the cameraman's back with the more talented car brother. Before you say anything in the comments, that's me. While Stuart was away, I was filling my boots. Yeah, well, we uh, we were stood at the number one peg, and there was quite a few partridges actually curled back round, which were pretty good, but they were they were challenging, uh, and uh, actually uh, enjoyed it. So look. Red deer coming out.
The guns fall silent after an unforgettable drive. And we keep on shooting, swiftly heading to drive number four. Simon! Indecision. Too many to go out there. Yeah, just picking them. You got the bird though, behind. Oh yeah, I got it behind, but I mean, just basic mis mistake, just like not picking a bird. I should, yeah, have, yeah. should have had two or three more birds there. The bag is growing nicely. Nessie says it's time for one more drive to finish the day. Sean takes the hot seat for this one. Let's see what he can do.
The horn brings an end to another excellent day's sport with a shotgun. Pheasant, partridge and a small number of woodcock are in the bag. I'll let the other car have the last word. Over to you, Sean. Yeah. Another cracking day at Bert and Agnes. Uh, just counted the birds out there. 144 was the bag. Uh, mainly pheasants, 14 partridge. Really good day. The guys enjoyed it. Uh, it's not a lot of wind, but we still got some good birds. So really pleased. Fantastic day at Bert Agnes there, and now it's the Shooting Show news. Some truly spectacular birds there, and now it's the Shooting Show news. This is the Shooting Show news. Basque has been busier than ever getting newcomers involved in shooting. It says it introduced more than 16,000 people to the shooting sports last year, across 46 events including game fairs, charity shoots, private events and schools. Chairman Peter Glenzer said shooting sports are something anyone can take part in and we are heartened to see so many new people trying it for themselves. The regional finalists have been revealed in this year's Countryside Alliance Awards. More than 17,000 nominations were whittled down to the shortlist for each region in five categories – local food and drink, village shop or post office, butcher, rural enterprise and pub. Regional title winners will then go head-to-head -head for the national title, announced in a ceremony at the House of Lords. New figures indicate that wildlife crime has dropped by 11% in Scotland. Fish poaching remains the most common form of crime, with very few game poaching offences recorded. Notably, the number of hunting with dogs offences has dropped by 50%. Despite this, the Scottish Government wants to press ahead with legislation to restrict the use of packs of dogs to flush animals to waiting guns. And finally, with voting still taking place in the Great British Shooting Awards, we take a look at one of the categories you can have your say in. This week it's the Shotgun of the Year Award, and the nominees are Blaza F16 Heritage Game, Browning B525 Ultra XS Pro, Fausti XF4, Parazzi High Tech S, Zolly X Bella. Which do you think should win the award? Have your say by heading to GreatBritishShootingAwards.com. That was the Shooting Show News. Well, that's it for this week. Thanks for watching. Please like us on Facebook and follow us on Twitter. And if you're not a member of Basque, it's time to join now. Basque, looking after your sport, looking after you. This has been The Shooting Show.